Good evening. It's a Sunday evening. I've been at Mum's today, as always on a Sunday. It's currently 10.29. We'll probably go over at 10.30 very soon. Uh, the 21st of May. It's Mum's birthday, Friday. This coming Friday, that is. I don't actually know why I haven't done a video yet. Well, I do. I keep deleting the damn footage. Because <laughs> if I'm not happy with it, I just wipe it and start again. So, uh, I'm going to do an update as fast as I can. So, probably about 30 minutes. <laughs> um, Wednesday, last week, Cat's Custom Trikes came over. Um, on her Schwinn chopper bike thing. She's now got dynamo lights fitted. I think it took me about an hour to get the damn things to work. Trying to figure out why they wouldn't work. What I hadn't realised is, or, what, or it took me so long to realise this, that it wasn't just one problem. It was two problems, and it was actually with each light. Nothing wrong with the dynamo or the actual wiring itself, just... The connections at each light were the problem. Yeah, it took me an hour to figure that out. Shut up. <laughs> anyway, um, she was going to come over Thursday as well, but her back played up, so that sort of uh, threw a spanner in the works on that one, unfortunately. Uh, but she's got a trailer of stuff sitting out back. She's going to relieve me of quite a few items, her stereo, the Sony speakers that are under there with the stereo, which are a damn good pair of speakers, but I don't have a use for them. I could put them on my Marantz system over there, but they just, they don't look right, they don't go with that system. The system's black, the speakers are silver, so I've got two two pairs of speakers over there now. I'll show you the other ones in a minute. I've got the ones that came with the stereo, the actual Morant speakers, and I've got a set of Awas on top. Um, other than that, I've not really done a great deal since Wednesday. One, because my hemorrhoid had played up. It's actually a lot better at the minute. Touch wood, I don't want to talk that up. Um, <laughs> we think my brother's got IBS. And as he's got pretty much just identical symptoms as me, the well, chances are I'll have IBS as well. But I think I'm going to get myself checked again. I say again because when I was... I can't remember, I think it was my late teens, early 20s, I went through all various blood tests, stool samples, bowel samples, to try to uh, get to the reason why my tummy acts as it is, and they all came back negative. But uh, maybe they just weren't looking for the right thing back then, so I might pursue that again, especially as it seems to have just gotten worse as I've gotten older to be honest. It's one reason I don't actually like to go anywhere because I'm always worrying where the nearest toilet is just in case my tummy decides you know you're going to the toilet dude. Because <laughs> it's really annoying and not nice if you're sitting on some like a bus or something with no loo and your guts decide you need to go to the toilet buddy. That ain't nice trying to nip your butt up. Anyway, right, yeah, so I can't really talk about a lot that went on Thursday and Friday and Saturday because I really didn't do a lot. Uh, usual drama on Facebook. <laughs> um, an ex friend of mine, in fact, he's a member was a member on a group I admin for a friend um, called Classic Car Graveyard 
So we weren't really friends, I don't even know why, cause he added me yonks ago, ages ago. Might have been a year or two ago, I can't remember, that was a while ago. But anyway, bottom line is, he posted a post, basically saying, you know, it was a meme saying cops only give tickets for the revenue. Which I'm not going to deny that that isn't true. But I did make the... Well, that's all I did. It wasn't that I didn't like his post or anything like that. I just wanted to make a counterpoint. That a lot of laws, traffic laws, are actually there for our safety. Even though, as my sister pointed out today, some speeding limits in some areas don't make any sense anyway. But... Now, because basically, I also said, you know, the law is the law. If you don't want the ticket, don't break the law. <laughs> Simple, isn't it? You know? Even if it is just revenue generating, don't give them the satisfaction of um, taking your money. <laughs> That's probably, that is probably the reason why it became a revenue generator anyway, because they know so many people break traffic laws. So they probably thought, oh, we know what sort of punishment to give these people. Fines! <laughs> but, uh, yeah, anyway. Um, but uh, it was just his reply. It was so rude. So aggressive. He even told me to go suck a cock, you wanker. <laughs> I'm sort of thinking, well, I've been called worse things than a wanker, but... <laughs> I've actually been called a lot worse things than a wanker. That was actually the, probably the tamest thing anyone's ever called me, but... Still, I just... And I have screen capped it on Facebook, so those that follow me on Facebook as well would have seen it, or you can go and see it. His reply just wasn't warranted, so I unfriended him and kicked him off the group. <laughs> Simple, you know. Because he saw what was it? He started off with um, "fuck you" and "fuck your comment" or your opinion, I should say. But yeah, that was just it. It was just. Well, it wasn't just my opinion. It was just my. Well, I was just applying a bit of logic, really. You know, it's not rocket science. I know it's annoying. My mum sticks to the speed limit, I have to admit, it's boring. But it still doesn't change the fact, you know, that if you're speeding and you get caught, then pay the fine. I mean, what would people actually prefer? A fine or a couple of weeks or a month in jail? I prefer to pay the fine because I like my freedom. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> um, well, I think that's pretty much the only thing that really annoyed me yesterday. Um, as far as My Little Pony goes, there's a lot of spoilers being posted online because Canada are now showing two episodes a week, two new episodes a week. One on Saturday, one on Sunday. Whereas in America and most other places, actually I think it's just America at the minute that might be airing it. I'm not aware of any channel or whatever here in England that's actually airing it. Are only airing one episode a week. As such, Canada is now up to episode 11, which I have watched. And... America's up to episode 7. And I keep seeing spoilers for 8, 9 and 10. Not 11 yet. Yet. Give it time. <laughs> um, posted to the group I admin. That's been driving me barmy. <sighs> I don't know how though. Because there's a big thing. A big pinned post right at the top of the group that says. No spoilers. And yet they still 
post it? Do they miss it somehow? I don't know how people miss it. Maybe they just get so excited they don't think to look at things like that. You know, they just post or share it, which is more than likely. <sighs> I actually didn't want to watch that far ahead. I wanted to stick to it on the American routine, you know, once every Saturday, but I've actually found by choosing to watch ahead I, it's made my life easier spotting the spoilers some of the admins have chosen not to I mean everyone can they're all being posted I've been watching them on daily motion so any one of us can go and watch it but some of us don't some of us don't want to which is absolutely fine you know so it's actually hard as well because uh, I want to talk to my fellow admins about the new episodes, but I know I can't. <laughs> I've got to bite my tongue, which is annoying as hell, <laughs> but uh, that was a choice I made. Um. Yeah, it's payday this week, isn't it? Hey. I haven't decided if I want to clear... Actually, I think I will. I was going to say I haven't decided if I want to clear off out that day for a few hours, because I haven't done in ages. I've been... Apart from going to Mum's, mostly once a week, unless, you know, there's a birthday or something, then I'll go over, like, twice a week. Like I will be this week, because I'll be going over Friday as well as Sunday. Um, I haven't been anywhere. I haven't even. One of my favourite towns in the area is Chroma. Absolutely love going there, so I'm really tempted. As I'm going to have the extra cash, because um, I haven't got no bills apart from my eBay fees, which I will pay. Of just getting on the train and buggering off there for the day, and I'll take this with me. I'll take it with me and uh, do a spot of film. I don't know if I'll do a spot of talking. I still haven't grown that much balls yet to talk to the camera in public like that. <laughs> it took me long enough to pick the camera up just to do this. You look at my first videos when I start to talk to the camera. Um, yeah. So I might do that. I'm going to look at Argos and see if there's any the Lego sets I can get on there or something My Little Pony related. Go and have a play in the arcades for a little while with my two pences. See if I can win anything. <laughs> I love playing those machines. I don't know why, I just really love playing the 2P machines, you know, the coin pushers. That's my plan for Thursday. Tomorrow's plan, though, which will be Monday the 22nd of May. This is where I'm actually going to pick you up. Oi! Straighten that up. Pick you up. I've actually come to the conclusion I might as well leave you on the tripod when at home, because, uh, I don't know, it's just easy. I seem to be able to hold it a bit steadier. I don't seem to be as shaky. I don't know, you tell me, am I as shaky with it? But anyway, this is the computer I was trying to sell at the car boot. It got in the rest, but not a great deal. That's the one I was trying to sell on Gumtree. No interest at all, even though that had the slightly better specifications. So what I decided to do, as you can see, is bring this one back home. I'm going to transplant the guts from this one into this case, because I think this is a better looking case than these are uh, generic Asus cases. I'm also going to steal the two, four gigabytes of RAM out of that one. I think that's what I put in there. I'll have to have a look um, and stick in this one. No, this one, rather, when I build it. We'll swap this and I'll put a card reader on it. Might have to change that because I think... 
it's an IDE, yes it is, I'll change that to SATA. I'll just take it out of this one. Has this got a card reader in it that I can pinch? Yes it has. Let's change the card reader. I've got a floppy disk drive on there. Yeah, change the power supply for the one in this one as well. Yeah, just basically transplant everything from this to this, because apart from that mark, it's a better case. And, uh, I could keep Windows 7 on it, but I'm going to, uh, remove this sticker. <laughs> I'm going to remove the XP sticker, that is, but I'll, uh, yeah. What the fuck was I saying? Oh yeah, it's got to run Windows 10. Install that on it. And I think uh, I might actually have more of a chance at selling one of these. Possibly. Because <laughs> that is a better looking case. I only had this up for 35 or, or near off, you know. I didn't think that was asking over the top. It may have been. But I didn't feel it was. Anyway, there's the AWA speaker, or one of them. The other one is obviously on the other speaker over there. I was sitting in the shed for ages and I decided to bring those up and uh, stick them up here. Oh, speaking of which, I did sort my um, shed out when Cat's Custom Trikes was here. And she uh, gave me a, a good helping hand with that. A good helping hand. A helping hand with that. I'm tired, I've had about three hours sleep. I just couldn't fall asleep last night. I don't know why. I went to, I think I sort of settled down at about 1.30am. Not 1, it was 2am as usual. And I just couldn't fall asleep. Last time I looked at the clock it was 6 o'clock. Then I fell asleep. Then I had a weird dream that I was actually visiting Japan. Or were Japanese. It was a fun dream. I can't complain. <laughs> but yeah. Right. Anyway. Hopefully, a friend of mine will be posting me a lamp this week. I've got lamps here to post to him. Not the uni lamp there, because I know he's already got some of them. I do believe he's got the spare bases for these, so I'm going to send him those or he can keep the circuits and bin the lenses but this one under this box flap there that's got to go and there's a Tildorn Pilot 360 in there and that one which I'm swapping for the lamp that he's going to post me I want to get that done either Thursday or Friday I might do it th um, Thursday uh, I'm going to do it in two boxes. One, because I haven't got a big box, and two, it's actually going to work out cheaper to do it two boxes. <laughs> I don't mind. Should only come up three pounds if I pack them right. Anywho. Uh, I don't think there's any other reason for me to come in here, to be honest. Should we go into the shithole that I call a kitchen? Because if I can find a half decent motherboard, I've got a half decent e machines case there as well that I can get working. Well, that case, but well, that's my XP case. My big XP case. Well, these under here, but they're. Um, worth nothing that one doesn't actually work that's got to be chucked this one I was gonna fix it up but I can't be bothered with that one anymore I'm gonna get in here and blitz this kitchen I think actually no not I think I know I've got to get in there and blitz the kitchen I'm tripping over vacuum cleaner pipe as to what I did yesterday was it yesterday I can't remember it was either yesterday or Friday that was got the rest of the cables up from the shed and uh, the power cables and took the fuses out of all the plugs and rescued any plugs I could because some of them were sealed good old sealed plug so 
both these PCs here, I'm going to stick it down again, hang on. Pardon me. <laughs> yeah, both of these had two gigs of RAM each, but this one had it via um, four 512s. <laughs> uh, that was all I had at the time. So, that's why I want to put the AMD motherboard from this machine into this case because it's got four RAM slots, to, um, two channels so I could even upgrade it to three but I think that's an odd number just sounds silly so but this one I'll get my finger in here eh, is uh, got two or one gig sticks in and I don't, I don't think I've got any more. Not one gig ones. Because if I did, then I'd stick those in there as well. Which is why I was going to steal the 4 gigabyte kit out of the HP one. Actually, let me turn a bit of light on the subject. I'm going to go down to this HP for a minute and just take that side panel off. Get in. In. There. Now do it. Oh, side so cover is off of this one. this one anyway so you know I figured I might as well just use this stuff on there and I know that's a fully working kit so that's why I was going to use this I don't know I don't know what I could use it well I suppose I can stick that in the HP for now Get that working. There's no point in me putting the RAM back in, is there, if I'm going to change the motherboard? I'll actually, take it up. Would it be possible to take it up to 3 gigabytes? That's 5300. PC 5300. What have we got here? Ah, those two are 42s. And I've got some more somewhere in the kitchen, which I'll go have a look at. I need my magnifying glass, I can't see this. My eyes, they're not good enough. I need to clean my magnifying glass. Jesus. Kingston, so it's not bad memory. Eh. Well, I suppose I could try that with it. As they say, it's either going to work or it isn't. I won't be able to get three or mine at least. It's not going to be perfect, it's just got to work for the time being, hasn't it? To try and get an upgrade for it. Good old clean, right. Got a gig. <laughs> I'm going to put the gig in here just so I know where it is. Bloody stand. Tripod, rather.
may take the hard drive out of this one yet because I can't remember which one of these has got the biggest hard drive. I think it's this one. I think. But I can't see. <laughs> It's a weird hard drive as well. I'll show you that because I'll film the transfer, but also I'll show you this. It's got SATA power, but it's also got a Molex power connector on it as well. Let's try and see what. Uh, yeah. Okay, so for the sh sheer hell of it, I could actually. Um, Put some extra rear USB ports on this. Yeah, it's got the DVI out on this as well. Firewire built in, it's got all sorts. Ooh. Right. That's my job for tomorrow then. Let me done up here. Hmm. Can't raise this bit. Whoa! Well, I can drop you. Oh! Well, that's going to be better doing jobs like this, isn't it? Because, uh, I can put you like that and you can just sort of, sort of see. Cool! I totally forgot the tripod did that. <laughs> Sweet! It's a bit shaky when I do that still, isn't it? Right. Um. Do what I'm going to do with the um, case. I could just build another computer for the heck of it. It's not like I'm short on motherboards, is it? Anyway, I think I've rambled on enough. I really can't think of anything that I might have missed. So, I'm going to get this video up on the computer. May Actually, yeah, I will do it tonight. So, thanks a lot for watching. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, give me a thumbs down and tell me how crap it was. Other than that, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you all again later. Bye.